What's going on everybody? It's just Spiral Spartan here and welcome back to Spyro 3 Year of the Dragon. In the last episode we made it through the Spooky Swamp and the Enchanted Tower. And now we're heading towards the Bamboo Terrace. Uh, if I remember correctly, these guys are pandas. I mean, it makes sense with being the Bamboo Terrace and all. But, yeah, if I remember correctly, this is uh, all pandas. I hope you're all having a absolutely wonderful, wonderful week so far. It is Wednesday, my dudes. And I am starting this off with one of my favorite stacks, a nice ride chip. Now, ride chips are honestly my favorite little snack to have on hand. They're just one of my favorite little things. Out of, they come out of Chex Mix, Spyro. mainly, but... Have been harassing us oh, right. I forgot the names. The Ling Ling. Been able to harvest the bamboo needed for the Whirligig to take you to Evening Lake. We've tried asking them to leave, but there's no reasoning with them. The Whirligig. I love that term. It's almost as great as thingamajig. And whatchamacallit. Like, those are some of the best damn terms ever. Oh, you swipe. You don't smack. Okay, cool. So we saved the two pandas and they moved the stone. Awesome. But most likely there is stuff all around this area. So we're going to go ahead and grab all of it. Because there is nothing better than no stone left unturned. Unfortunately, for whatever reason, in the past few episodes, past few episodes we've been missing some gems and it's been utter BS because I have no idea where the heck these gems could be going off to all right so I think we got all the gems here as many as we can at least all right thank you pandas all right we got some uh, paratrooping uh, freaking Rhinox over here that we're going to take nice care of real quick like. Ow. Ow. Stop. SDHP, stop. I know you guys want help, but you got to, you know, at least be willing to take a hit or two. Because we can easily take all of this out. That's no issue. Can I... Yeah. Oh! What in the world? Seriously? That should have been an easy glide. I should not have had any issue with that. That's complete and utter bull crap. Like, come on. Seriously? I just realized I've been recording for like almost three and a half hours now. Like, that's insane. What the heck? That... Like, no! Like, seriously? I don't want to be reigniting. No, there should be no reason I'm reigniting. I mean, for the love of fudge, it's a simple jump glide. I should have no issue at all taking that out. No, you're getting the heck out of here. You are not going to be bothering that panda lady anymore. I don't know if I need to be burning any of this bamboo, but I'm going to be burning this bamboo. There. What, are you pulling this lever? Pulling the lever, extending the bridge. Sweet. Now we can get across. But first things first. Yeah. Fire. That burns down the whole town. Yep. There. There. That's simple. That was simple. But I know it's. I know up there was to get over to there. So I'm gonna have to go back around now and go up there and get it. So. But at least I went and got that damn egg. Which is the whole point of me doing that. Yep, and I can easily... There we go. And there's another egg. Sweet. All of the eggs. Get everything that we physically can. Madison! Hi! Okay. 
I forgot how many eggs are in this game. I think there was 120? Uh, don't quote me on that, because I don't remember in the slightest. Uh, more water. But yeah, so, this is probably, like, don't... Ooh! Ooh, ooh, hi. Hello. That's a, that's a wall. Was there seriously four freaking, uh, jars in there that had extra lives in there? That's insane. Alright, cool. So we got extra lives. That's always nice. Burn. Burn, baby, burn. Disco Inferno, burn, baby, burn. Alright. Now, which way... Okay, so we go the other way. Because this is just a way to get back. Okay. So, this is the correct way to go. So we're going to follow this all the way around. Okay, so I do need to get over there somehow. And the definitely question is definitely going to be how. Because I don't see any way of getting over there. Without just gliding. But I don't think I can get there by gliding. Now, nope, there's no secret behind the waterfall. At least I don't think there is. Seriously? Can I dive? I can. There is stuff in here. Oh, goody, goody. I'm kind of glad I did that. Because I would have been furious if I could not find anything. And it's like, oh yeah, you're missing like 10 gems. Where the heck are they? Like, why can't I find them? It's because they were all right there in the freaking open. And I was just too ignorant to see it. Alright. Now where do we go from here? I know we gotta go in the building, but I'm trying to see if there's anything around the building that I need to get. There is. See, this is why we check everywhere. Because if I wouldn't have, I would have missed all of this. Okay. So now we go up and in. And that's probably the final panda that we need to talk to. Saying thank you for everything. Oh, to all explorers, there is, n there is no Yeti uh, here, and there never was. He's just a myth as far as you know. The sorceress. Right, we get to play as a Yeti, too. I forgot that. Alright. Yep. Fly. Oh, I remember this. Okay. So this is a little, like, it's another challenge for an egg. We gotta go and find where all these are hidden. But every time we uh, f flame it or charge it, it tra teleports to another area. Which is sort of helpful that it gives us that little hint to where it could be. So if you actually know the game like I do, you'll be able to tell exactly where it is. That's by the front entrance, I believe. No, it's actually just right over here. Okay. That's by the starting area, because I can see the uh, where we came in. Did I seriously miss you? How did I miss you? Like, seriously, how did I miss you? And that's on the other side of the starting boulder. So it's right out here. And I think that's the last one, right? No. Come on. Don't be stupid. Use your brain. But I don't want to use my brain. Tons of gems. See, now we got to get up there. Did I not get... I was going to say, did I not get you? Okay, how do we get up there? That's my main question. Because we are still... Like... Freaking holy shit, we are a hundred and almost two hundred gems away. And I know for a fact that the Yeti area probably has like a hundred, at least. 
I don't think it would have no 200 gems. We've checked that water. We've checked that water in there. There still just has to be a way to get over there. But I don't see it. Like, I know there's a way. There's gotta be a way. But, for whatever reason, I cannot think of it. Oh! We would be honored if you would accept that would be the way. token of our appreciation. Sure, I'll accept it. Thank you. I hear an egg thief. I hear an egg thief. You little piece of crap, get back here. You're gonna use the yep, you're gonna use that bridge now, aren't you? Come back here! You piece of crap, you dirty ape, you! I'm just taking him out right now. Oh, I don't have to worry about him later. Nope. Got him. I got Pee Wee! Pee Wee Sherman! Uh, if you're too young to get the reference, just look it up. Pee Wee Sherman, he was, he created, he had like a, his own little like fun house. It was really cool. Had like talking couches and stuff. It was great. Uh, really old school, uh, like like Saturday morning show. Right, there was a whole nother area for Spyro in here too. Oh my goodness. Please help us, Spyro. My friends are trying to go home after a long shift in the fields. Those rotten Rhinox keep knocking them down. Can you save the panda workers? I mean, I can give a shot, sure. All oh, right. This is one where we actually have to, like, just physically fire at them. Okay. This is where you gotta know where every little nook and cranny is, unfortunately. And you gotta be able to make, like, really, really somewhat... Not difficult shots, but shots in the shots and a half. Okay, I think there is only two more. Was that the last one? I think that might have been the last one. Are we good? I think we're good. Oh, nope. Right. No! Sure I was almost there. I forgot it, it goes around to doubles. And Damn it. Make sure to toast yep, yep. I'm going to hop board now. Because I forgot that these two have to meet in the set. Oh my gosh. I am an idiot. I forgot all about that. Okay. Bob. Uh, I wish there was a way to speed up the boat. I really do. But thankfully, there's no, like, limit on how much I can fire. So I can just rapid fire this. To make sure I get them out as fast as possible. Now, if I was smart, I would have hit this guy, like, through that, that, that gap that was there earlier. Now, I'm actually going to start firing over there, because that's where he's going to appear from. Oh my gosh, really? I can actually hit them? Oh my gosh. Oh. I thought we were going to get through this level in, like, literally less than, ten, like, 15 minutes, but no. It's not going to, we're going to, it's going to be a while. I forgot we can hit these little mother fudgers. Because as long as, you know, we, we don't hit them, we're fine. Uh, 
Like I think right there I hit I I hit the uh, one that was yeah. Did I seriously hit one? Succeed if you were to try again. Please help. No. 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 We'll be right back. I'm gonna you know cut this a few of these out. Please take. All right. The there we go. We finally luck. got it. Bring me good luck. It brought me nothing but bad luck. I don't know what the heck you're talking about. Hi, Rusty. How you doing? I don't know if you get any gems for this. I really don't. I don't think you do. As weird as that is, you don't get any gems for that, don't you? No. Smash the mountaintop, which I think that egg is in the, uh... Whatchamacallit. Is in, uh... What's his name? The Yeti's place. So I think that's everything we can do at this in this uh, level. Because I'm pretty sure... Oh, I'm an idiot. Wait a minute. Is there a way? Is there something I can get through here? Nope, nothing. Okay. I, you know, you, some of these like old school games had like these weird secret areas. I figured there might be one there. I for it's been so long since I played this. I forgot. But, yeah, we're gonna return home real quick. Is that it? Is the whirly gig done? Are we seriously done with this area? I guess we're done with this area. Sweet. Alright, to the evening lake. Alright, entering Spikes Arena. Alright, so the next boss fight. I think we only got um, one or two more uh, areas after this. So it's either this one and one more, or there's two more after this one. You bumbling, idiotic, worthless fool! I asked you to carry out one. And this is why I hated her as a boss. Me. I should have known better than to rely on a child. But don't worry about it. I'll deal with them now. The sorceress is a pain These in the butt. Can't be worth all this trouble. Without the dragons, the magic in this world will wither away. Without magic, I'll die. Yeah. And so will your ever slim chance of becoming a sorceress. Now, what a real sorceress dispatches her enemies. Release me from this cage, you merciless miscreants. How would you like All some right. dragon for lunch? <laughs> <laughs> I forgot, Benty's Betty, Benty the Yeti. What the heck? You don't be in full. What in the absolute world? Oh, this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be a challenge. All right, we got. We got some time to take out this this guy now. My tactical instincts told me the sorceress would attack you here, so I flew in to help out. It seems my rocket launchers don't affect this creature, All right. but I can assist you by dropping ammunition. Now get in there and fight the good fight. All right, cool. So drop me some ammo then. You know, as long as he doesn't destroy it. Sergeant Bird, a little help would be wonderful. Oh, okay, so I need to push those into him. Good. Good to know. Good to know. Bop. Alright, we exchanged hits. We exchanged hits. We can still do this. Bop. Alright, line the shot up and. Ooh! Okay. Damn. Okay, I was trying not to let him hit that, but sure, we'll go with that. Okay, come on. Nope, he's gonna get rid of it. Damn. Okay, I wasn't fast enough. Where? Sergeant Bird, a little help here, buddy. A little help here is greatly appreciated. Alright. Two down, like, th like four to go, roughly, I want to say. What the heck? Ow. Ow. Shoot. This is not good. 
What the heck? Sergeant Bird! No! I'm downed. Alright. We can do this. Like, this shouldn't be that hard. Like, now that I know what to do, we should be able to get through this in like two minutes. Maybe a little bit more, depending on how fast I can take out all, take out the first, like, good chunk of his health. Alright. Fire! Alright, give me more fire, Sergeant Bird. I'm gonna need all that ammo that you can give me. Oh! No! Shoot, 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 shoot. Ow. Butt on fire. No. No, 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 no. You burn. No, 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 buddy. You're the one that's going to get taken out of this. Hey, Sergeant Burn, a little help here. Thank you. All right, one more and he is out of here. Hey, Sergeant Bird, can you not drop it next to him? That'd be wonderful. I got it. There we go. I was going to say, I got it. it. I was able to stop him from getting it. But we end up taking a hit, which that's fine. Alright, we got the egg. Let's get the ever-loving flock out of here. On to the, wor on to the uh, whirly gig. That's what it was called, right? The whirly gig? Or the I forgot the name of it. Oh, well. Like, why is my neck going into the green screen? That's so weird. Like, for whatever reason, this green screen is acting really weird today. Oh, I think it's because of the green on the background of the game. Yeah, that's messy with the green screen, like, badly. Because, see, now we're fading back into normal. Yep. So, anything with green... Kind of screws the green screen up. Okay, good to know. Hi, Bianca. Listen to me, Dragon. Spyro, this is serious now. The sorceress is planning a trap for you, and if she catches you, believe okay. me, you don't want to know what she's going to do. Look, I promise to take good care. I'm of pretty the sure I'd eggs. be fine. I mean Just take Hunter and go back home before, before. Before, yeah, I know. You, before you, anything gets worse, but don't worry, we'll be fine. Like I can pretty sh much take care of this. What the heck? Hello? Um, that was weird. That was super weird. I have no idea what just happened. We had a glitch in the system. We had a glitch in the matrix, guys. Froggies, come here. I need all of you. I need all of your help. Because, oh, yay. There's underwater worlds. <laughs> Just what I did not want in the slightest. Alright, so I'm probably going to go ahead and take care of most of this world's uh, stuff off camera. This power-up can make you invincible, but only for a short while. Use it to get by these flame spitters. You'll find an egg when you get past them. I see the egg, yeah. Alright, so that's gonna make us invincible. Sweet. And damn, it was a sh literal short while. But we got Stuart. Stuart Little, baby! But yeah, so we're gonna try and get through as much of this uh, homeworld as possible before the end of the episode. Because uh, after this episode ends, I'm probably just going to do a bunch of off-screen camera, off-screen grinding and getting the rest of this world's gems and everything. So I want to get through as much of it as possible on camera with you guys. So that way, if any of you are following along playing this game at home, you can see where all of these gems and all the eggs are. All right, now that's where that is. Is there any special places we can't get to without flying from up here? 
Not to my knowledge, so we'll just fly right over to here. Okay. Now, it looks like most of this world is underwater, unfortunately, so down we go! Oh, there's a giant whale. Hello? Can I, can I not hit the whale? Thank you. Like, I don't want to hit the whale. The whales are freaking awesome, and they are friendly as all heck. I don't want to hit the whale. Alright. But yeah, so we should be able to bust out a good chunk of this area's uh, gems and, and whatnot. Um, is there any gems behind here? No gems behind there. Okay. So I'm just basically just going around trying to find all the four gems. And then I will slowly work my way up. Because guaranteed there's some gems like up here and stuff like that trying to hide from us. Hello? I know there's one up here. There we go. Alright. Okay, got some more. Oh no, I see another speedway. I see another dreaded speedway. And that's something I am not liking right now. Okay. So, Frozen Atlantis. I remember that world. That's probably one of my that's probably one of my favorite worlds in this game. Well, not in this game, but in this area, I should say. Cuz Frozen Atlantis had probably one of the best soundtracks for this game. Uh, what was in here? Fireworks factory. Another fun, fun level. Uh, but I do think we need the, uh, the Yeti for that. So I'm actually going to be looking around for the Yeti. Because I'm pretty sure this is where we find him. Is in this area. Just like in the cutscene with uh, Sergeant Bird. We found him in the next world. Uh, because Yeti was in that last cutscene. I'm pretty sure this is where we'll find Sar uh, Betty the Yeti. Or Bentley the Yeti I should say. I always forget that it's Bentley as in like a, a like a like the car Bentley. Lost Fleet. That's another that's a pirate level. That's actually a pretty fun one. A lot of these are gonna be fun to play through in the neck in the next few episodes. So I'm actually super pumped to get all these like going. Alright, what's in here? This is yep, there's Bentley. Alright, how much is it, money bags? Is it another 700? Because if so, I think we got it. And we're already at almost 300 of the ah, gems the here. Sorceress has a real prize on her hands here. It took two dozen Rhinox. Yeah, he does. Dim witted furball. So you Damn. Can believe he's not going to get out cheap. A thousand gems. Okay, sure. <laughs> Don't worry about it, money bags. Ground, is it? Uh, is it? Yes. Ah, yeah, uh, Bentley. Uh, the first rejuvenating breath of freedom. With the humility of a wounded sparrow, I genuflect to my noble deliverer. Uh, it was no big deal, dude. Yes. <laughs> yeah. After all, it was I who let you out. Why, you brazenly avaricious, duplicitous, larcenous ursine! Now hold on! Damn! I'm okay with this. At least. At least. Please do afford me the sublime honor of enjoying your visitation in the nearest future. Yeah, sure. Sure. We could definitely hang out more, Bentley. All right, so we were able to take uh, get Bentley. So we'll definitely be doing his at the start of next episode. Uh, we'll be going through and doing his. Uh, but for right now, with that, I'd like to thank you all for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to smack that like button down below, comment, and subscribe for more amazing content such as this. And until next time, this has been your Spyful Spartan. Signing out. Stay frosty, everyone. Peace!